saw a yard long fish, you know, he was fatty, he got close to me like, I left, I freaked out. They don't fear you, they get so close to you, they just keep, you know, looking for food, just swimming normally. They're my best friends. Oh yeah, your best friends? Yeah, yeah. what did they tell you for you to think like that? They said that you look good, Gordo. Oh! It's amazing. Look at the line at this place. Oh my God. Here, thank you. Here they claim to have the best malasadas in town. So we're here to try. Uh, we got the traditional ones. They're, they have no filling. And I got one with cinnamon too to try. Which one is which here? Because it's all the same. <laughs> it looks all the same. Well, it's so hot. Oh, this is heavy. I think this has a filling. Yeah, this has a filling. So I guess that's cinnamon. So this is the traditional one. So hot. It is so hot. It's like it just came out of the oven. Mmm, it is so fluffy. It's so perfect. Although there's no feeling, this one here, it is delicious. Mm. Mm. This is even better than donuts because it's so fluffy and so fresh. So it is really worth it to me here. It's delicious. You like? Mm-hmm. your mouth. <laughs> You're all dirty, am I too? <laughs> so with or without feeling? With. Yeah. Yes. You had what, the coconut? Yeah. We got a car for the day. Today we rented a car and this was the only one they had. Wow, this parking lot and the park around are already so beautiful. Can't imagine the beach. This is Hanauma Bay and it's considered a great place for snorkeling. I can understand why. Look at all the coral reefs. And the water seems so crystal clear. Oh my God, look at this place. Hi. Two tickets, please. $50. Yeah. Your receipt and two tickets. Orientation around the corner. Okay, thank you. Okay. And then down to the beach. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Really popular place. Look at this. This is a nature preserve. So there's a fee for you to get in. And there's also an educational presentation about the importance of not touching corals, not feeding the fish. And you see this tram? They charge 125 each way if you want to go up and down, or 250 to go up and down as many times as you want. Only after that, you're ready for paradise. beautiful thing ever. So many colored fish, big and small, so enormous. I saw a yard long fish, you know, he was fatty. He got close to me like, I left, I freaked out. We 
here they have snorkeling equipment to rent, you know, masks, fins, everything. We brought our own, and if you don't have one, I think it's even better to buy one at Walmart. It would be probably the same price as renting for two days, for example. And it is so worth it because it's so beautiful. You see all kinds of fish, colored fish, like different species you'd never see anywhere. And they don't fear you. They don't fear you. They get so close to you. They're not afraid at all. They just keep, you know, looking for food, just swimming normally. You forget about time there. You just start swimming. You see all the corals, the fish, the water is crystal clear. It was amazing. Did the fish scare you away? No. They're my best friends. Oh yeah, your best friends? Yeah. yeah. What did they tell you for you to think like that? They said, you look good, Gordo. Oh, you look like Sting? Did no. they say that? <laughs> it's amazing how busy the beach is. Look at how many people at the ocean and for the fish, same as nothing, life as usual. There's nothing for sale here, only up there in the parking level. But if you bring your water bottle, there's a drinking fountain here. leaving and a seal appeared here. Right here in shallow waters. This place is amazing. Halona Blowhole Lookout. When you leave Hanauma Bay, this is a nice place to stop for a quick view because there's something interesting that happens here. Here, when the wind is strong and the tide is high, the ocean water comes underneath the rocks and it comes out like a geyser. You need the perfect conditions. It's not always that it is very intense. So see, there's a little bit over there. It is so nice. There's this parking lot right here. Very convenient. If you're feeling like exercising, there's a nice hike. You can do it. It's considered an easy hike, fully paved. Just a five minute drive from the viewpoint. But uh, we're actually gonna hit another beach. Look at how interesting the weather here in Hawaii. Sunny over here, raining over there. We're now in Lanikai, and here there's no public parking. So during high season, it might be really difficult <laughs> to find a space here. You gotta park on the street, like these cars. And I was talking to people here, and you need to pay close attention to the no parking signs because you can get a ticket. The color of this water is unbelievable. And back here, some amazing houses. Now, it could also be a coincidence because it's now later, but this is so much quieter compared to Hanauma Bay. Feeling cold now? Oh, come on. <laughs> Is the water cold? It's cool. Colder than Hanama Bay? Yeah. Oh. Um... Not much. Yeah, water is slightly colder here. <laughs> in the bottom, no rocks, and uh, your feet really go now. <laughs> also no fish here. 
You easily get used to the water. You better not sit in a car like this. <laughs> What an amazing day, so many beautiful places. Before going back, we just wanted to check out another beach very close to Lanikai. Lanikai is right over there, after that curve. You see, very close. So here's already Kailua. What's amazing here, the day's not even beautiful anymore. It's cloudy, about to rain, it's already sprinkling. And the color of this water, it is so impressive. Both beaches here are perfect for stand up paddle, kayaking, canoes. No worries. Look at this green. It's amazing. Mm, look at how much for parking here close to Waikiki Beach. $20. Look at this healthy meal now to close the day. Fresh poke from the grocery store for less than $7. I'm loving this. During the day, you see these sticky torches like this everywhere, but I think it's just decor, right? At night, they're all lit. It's so beautiful. After the beach, don't even think about staying at a hotel. We just returned the car, and if tomorrow we needed a car again, we'd rent another one. That's because most hotels in Waikiki charge a really expensive parking fee. It's like $30. So imagine 30 after 30 after 30 every day. It's not worth it, unless you have plans for the evening. We do have plans for the evening, but luckily, we can just walk. And look at what a nice walk. Every night in Waikiki looks like a party, but tonight is special. for free organized by the Hilton Hotel right here in front of the hotel there's a lagoon you can come here even if you're not at the hotel you know how you see the amount of people that were here it is so nice perfect way to end this day in the next video you'll see Maui then the big island and at the end of the trip we come back to Oahu I'll show you the North Shore If you don't have, 